What's up, everybody, and welcome back to the history of Goju Ryu. I'm the Goju Ryu philosopher, and today's subject is one of the most interesting students of Miyagi Chojun Sensei that we've covered so far. He was especially known for his emphasis on hand conditioning, and was known to even break the stiff, spring like boards of the Makiwara, a traditional karate tool of hand posture and strike training. He was also an accomplished calligrapher, producing some of the best reproductions of the Eight Laws of the Fist, the poem from which Goju Ryu takes its name, that have ever been put to brush. This episode is on Yagi Meitoku, the founder of the Meibukan. Let's get into it. Yagi Meitoku Sensei was born in 1912 in the Kume village of Naha, Okinawa. His family traces itself back to the 36 families sent to Okinawa from China, and he is also a descendant of one of the Uekata aristocrats of the Ryukyu Kingdom's feudal system. He began training with Miyagi Sensei in 1926 at the age of 14, spending his first year entirely on Sanchin Kata. According to the account given by Yagi's son Meitetsu, at the time, Miyagi Sensei's training usually only included Sanchin, Seisan, and Seiyunchin Katas, meaning that when Yagi was taught all of the 12 core kata, it was considered a rare honor. Of course, he was not the only of Miyagi's students to receive this full instruction, but his knowledge of the full Goju Ryu curriculum was a matter of pride for Yagi Sensei, and he would later be responsible for teaching the rest of the kata to certain other Goju Ryu masters, most famously Yamaguchi Gogen Jitsumi. Yagi Sensei studied with Miyagi until the latter's death before establishing his school, the Meibukan, in 1953. He also worked closely with Miyagi's other senior students, forming the Okinawa Goju Kai, not to be confused with the Japanese organization bearing the same name, which sought to promote Goju Ryu. He also continued to promote karate with the masters of other styles, and was one of the founders of the Zen Okinawa Karate Do Renmei with Uechi Kane, Nagamine Shoshin, and Higa Yuchoku of Uechi Ryu, Matsubayashi Ryu, and Shoren Ryu, respectively. This organization helped to promote karate not only as a type of martial arts, but also as a budo, worthy of respect along with other Japanese systems such as kendo and judo. Yagi Meitoku Sensei created five additional kata to expand the Goju Ryu syllabus, which are said to be influenced by Chinese martial arts studied either in Kume Village or practiced in Taiwan, where Yagi Sensei traveled and studied. These kata, known as Tenchi, Seiryu, Byakko, Shujaku, and Genbu, are unique to the Meibukan style and demonstrate the hard work that Yagi Sensei put into expanding and improving his Goju Ryu across his lifetime. Yagi Sensei also pursued other passions outside of the martial arts and was well known in many fields. Most notably, Yagi Sensei was accomplished at Chinese calligraphy and used his knowledge of literature and brushwork as a poet. He was also an accomplished musician and player of a Chinese chess game similar to the Japanese shogi. Additionally, true to his nickname of Makiwara Breaker, Yagi Sensei promoted arm strength and conditioning, a tradition still emphasized by the Meibukan to this day. Yagi Sensei received one of the highest honors possible when in 1986 he was named a national treasure and received the Fourth Order of Merit from Japan's Showa Emperor. This honor was followed by several recognitions such as the intangible cultural asset from the Okinawa prefectural government. Yagi Sensei's two sons, Meitatsu and Meitetsu, both trained underneath him until they became positioned to inherit his place as heads of the Meibukan organization, the former serving as president of the International Meibukan Goju Ryu Karate Association, and the latter serving as the president of the Hombu Dojo in Kume Village. In 2003, Yagi Sensei passed away, leaving a storied legacy and many students. Thank you so much for watching this video. If you haven't already, please check out the rest of the History of Goju Ryu series, as well as the other videos on this channel. If you enjoyed this video, please like it and leave a comment letting me know who you'd like to see me cover next. While you're down there, hit the subscribe button and notification icon so that you can be notified when I upload the rest of this series. I've been the Goju Ryu Philosopher, and go break some Akiwara!